Hey everyone, this is a quick instructional video for the Acoustic Audio by Goldwood AA5170 Bluetooth Home Theater Speaker System. In this video, we will review system setup, features, functions, and troubleshooting. You can skip to your desired topic using the time codes in the description below. Now let's get started. Setting up your system is pretty simple. Each speaker is marked on the rear to indicate the corresponding output on the back of the subwoofer. Each speaker comes with a built-in RCA cable. Front and center speakers have a 6-foot cable, while rear speakers have a 12-foot cable. The center speaker should be placed front and center, front speaker should be in front of the listener, while rear speaker should be behind the listener. The subwoofer should be low to the ground and facing the listener to achieve the best bass effects. Once your speakers are placed, use the rear indicators to plug in your speakers to their appropriate output. Make sure the connection is secure. You have a few different options to input music or audio sources. You can use the included AUX cable and AUX input to easily connect to your TV, computer, laptop, tablet, or smartphone in AUX mode. You can also use the supplied RCA cable to connect to many sources in DVD mode. The system also includes a six speaker RCA output to connect to an HD DVD. Connect the RCA antenna to achieve the best FM frequencies in FM mode. And finally, the USB and SD card inputs allow you to play audio from a preloaded flash drive or SD card. Just make sure the files are MP3s. Now that you're connected, plug in and turn on the system. You will notice four blinking lines. Press the standby button on the remote or front panel. You can also use the remote or front panel to toggle between modes, change the volume, station, or track. The system comes in 2.1 mode using only two satellite speakers. Simply press the 2.1 5.1 button on the remote, and all five speakers will then work in 5.1 mode. To get to Bluetooth mode, press source. You will notice a small blinking dot while the system searches for Bluetooth devices. On your device, turn Bluetooth on. You will then see BT speaker. Press connect. When the dot no longer blinks, you may play audio from your device. Here are a few basic troubleshooting tips. As mentioned earlier, the system comes in 2.1 mode. Simply press the 2.1 5.1 button to go to 5.1 mode. If this does not work, double check the RC cables are secure. If you experience a hum, make sure any cables not in use are unplugged. Some homes have a grounding issue with the home wiring. Simply unplug the system from the wall, plug in the surge protector, plug in the system and switch the surge protector on. Thank you for watching. For any further questions or to view more products, visit our website or subscribe to our YouTube channel.